everybody, my name is Teenage Wizard, and welcome to my video explaining what Guns of Icarus actually is. And by the way, the footage in the background is sped up. Guns of Icarus Online is a multiplayer steampunk game. You're on a ship with three other crew members, and in the most common game mode, which is a full on 2v2, your aim is to destroy the enemy ship and to reach 5 kills. This gameplay that you're watching right now is from this game mode. In this game you're part of a 4 crew airship with real other players. You always have 4 crew members on any airship even if you're flying as part of a fleet of 2, 3 or 4. You can choose from 3 different classes which are engineer, gunner and pilot. As you can probably imagine the engineer will fix things around the ship and occasionally hop on one of the guns when needed. The gunner will most of the time stay on the main gun which would normally be the one with the most range and power but that will be up to the gunner and the pilot to decide in game. And then there's the pilot class. You will need a lot of skill to fly one of these ships, and you'll need to take into consideration the gunner and the engineers. You don't want to work the engines too hard, or they'll break, and you don't want to give the, your gunner no chance to shoot. One of the things that many people do in this game is leave piloting until they are high level at gunning or engineering. But sometimes you get an odd few who've played many pilots in games before, and they are able to do it. But like I said, I've only seen one or two of these in my whole time playing. There are currently a wide range of ships to choose from, and you can customise them by placing different guns in different places, or just by adding decorations. A ship that I am on in this gameplay is called the Squid. It has a back facing gun, which not many ships have, but to counter for that, there is no gun on the left hand side. All of the ships in this game have good points and bad points, so when in battle, it all balances out and comes down to your pilot's tactics and your skill. The Guns of Icarus community is the best I've seen. If you want help, someone will even take you into a private lobby and teach you. If you need to know something in-game, even the enemy team will gladly tell you, which could change the outcome of a game. Weapons in this game are great fun to use, and if you are a good captain and put the right guns in the right places, you will be able to forget about repair and destroy the enemy in no time. Some guns in this game are like snipers, others are like machine guns, and they all have different strengths such as the gun that I was just using. It's called the Gatling gun. It's great for destroying holes, and then our front gun is good for finishing the ship off. I'm currently making tutorials for this game, so if you want to find out more, click your screen now. This game may look confusing at first sight, but once you play a few matches, you will learn the ship's layout, the best tools to use for repairing, and the best ammunition to use for different guns. This game does have a creator class system, where depending on which class you wanted to edit, engineer, gunner or pilot, you will have a different loadout. If I pick the engineer class, I will be able to have one piloting equipment, three engineering equipment, and one gunning equipment. If I pick the gunner class, I will be able to have one piloting equipment, one engineering equipment and three gunning equipment. Same will go for the pilot. Three piloting equipment, one engineering equipment and one gunning equipment. Not that you would normally find a pilot on a gun. Like I said earlier, this game may seem a bit confusing, but if you are interested in this game, I do have a tutorial series. And if you do want to visit it, just click the screen now or there will be a link in the description. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comments, or if you feel like asking a lot of people, head over to the forums. I think that that brings an end to this video. If you think I missed the key thing, please leave a comment down below. If you guys are interested in buying this game, I have a link where you can get it for a few pounds. So if you're interested, there will be a link in the description and also an annotation on screen. Also, if you're interested, don't forget to watch my tutorial series. If you guys have enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment your feedback and subscribe. I'll see you guys on my next video. Goodbye.